In Kvitfjell, it all started as a project for the Winter Olympics in 1994. And 25 years later, thanks to the big efforts of the local organizing committee, the World Cup Kvitfjell became a classical speed week at the end of the World Cup season. It's great to win, but it was also a great feeling to finally have a speed event in Norway, that we finally had our downhill. And now we've been going for 25 years, and we also had the Olympics here in 94, so it gave a really good boost to Norwegian alpine skiing. Two of the spectators watching me and Lasse doing the downhill in 94 were Kjetil Jansrud and Axel Lundsvindal. So hopefully that inspired them to become alpine skiers. Kvitfjell as an arena has been a tremendous boost to Norwegian alpine skiing and I think also the athletes from all over the world really like to come here. In the end of the season it's really convenient, we live in the middle of the mountain and you have a very nice downhill course. Not too difficult maybe, but still it's the fastest man from the top of the mountain to the bottom of the mountain. That's what's interesting. I remember I was a gate judge on uh, the first years. Then before I ended up as a slipper. During the race, I'm I'm part of the race crew that is uh, ready if a gate or a flag you need to go out and fix it. Before and after, it's all the preparation with the course, uh, helping out where it's needed, <laughs> with water or um, removing snow, making it all ready for the guys to <laughs> race. Volunteers, they are the most important people here because they are doing the races. This year we did two Europa Cup races for the men. First time we did since we had the first races in 1992. So this has been very important for Norway to, to keep the level Hughes and Omot Hutt and Skordal Hutt on the 25 years ago. I know we have really a strong downhill team and that's very nice for us, which really love the Alpine ski sport. I've been here from the start, 25 years. I've been on the top with the manual timekeeping, all the intermediates, all the way down during these 25 years. This is my favorite intermediate because I can see all the people in the finish area and I can hear from the speaker who is leading the race. I think I was here in the World Cup in 93, but I definitely remember being here for the Olympics in 94. That was my first experience with Kvitfeld and the experience of growing up racing. The memories from the Olympics will definitely never fade. And then I skied a 4 under when I was 14 and now I'm here with a few victories as well. So it's, uh, it's been quite a journey. <laughs>